All right, hey guys, today I'm going to show you um, how to install applications on your N9 um, for Android, though. So if you are using um, Android on your N9, this will teach you how to install applications without having to um, connect to Wi-Fi, or if you can't connect to Wi-Fi. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to, you're going to open up this link it's going to be in the description and you're going to select Mac OS X and you're going to click right here and it's going to download then you're going to have to unzip it once it's unzipped you should get this little thing right here double click on it you should see less folders than I have right now because it won't be updated so to do this we need to update it so you need to go to your terminal and then what you're going to do is you're going to CD and then you're going to go to the path that this is in. Actually, yeah. You're going to do get info and all this. You're going to copy that. Just paste it in and then you're going to add to that Android SDK. Oh, Android slash SDK slash Mac OS X and then slash again and then you're going to do tools and then hit enter and then from there you're going to type in bash android Oopsies. so then what this is going to do this is going to run the android sdk um, manager thing so then wait for it to load and it'll tell you what you have installed. If you just downloaded it from the link in my description, then you need to um, do some things because you don't have like the full version that you need. So what you need to do is you're going to check this. Make sure you have this checked and check this as well. So you need these two things in order to do it. And then these are all already installed for me, so I can't install them. But you would just hit install packages and then it would go through its thing. Once you're done, you can just quit out of the application and then go back into um, <clears throat> terminal okay so now after that you should have all these folders exactly how I have them and open up platform tools you can do the same thing to get info and take all this so you're going to type in CD paste that in slash you're going to type in platform dash tools hit enter and then after that you're going to run dot slash adb devices and you should see that if you do not see that if you see um if you get an error or it says um, operation not permitted or something like that. You could try doing um, sudo. I believe it's t. Uh, actually, no. Hold on. I think I have it in here. Yeah, you're gonna do sudo t c s h, and you're gonna type in your password, and then you're gonna do c d to that directory platform dash tools and then hit enter and then you're going to do the dot slash adb devices okay now when you probably did this you probably didn't see anything um this is because you haven't set up um your n9 so what you're going to do is you're going to go to your little Wi-Fi icon thing. You're gonna open up network preferences. And then right here, well I'll just let me delete this really quick. Okay. You're gonna hit add. Make sure your N9 is plugged in before you hit add, before you hit the plus button. Then you should see this and then just hit create. And then from here go to manual address. It's gonna be one nine two dot one six eight dot two dot fourteen exactly how it is it's the same for everybody just hit apply and then it should say 
connected if you if you have your device plugged in. And then after that you can just quit out of that. Okay. So then in order to connect, you're going to type in this exactly. dot slash adb and you're going to type in connect. Then this is going to be just follow me here. It's going to be 192. dot 168.2.15 it's going to be different from the one you typed in up here it's 15 and it's going to be port number 5039 then you're going to hit enter and then it should say already oh well, yours will say connected to connected and then mine says already connected because I'm already connected but after that what you're going to do is you can just get rid of the the connect part and the IP address and you're going to type in dot slash adb then you're going to hit install and then you're going to um, type in where your um, app is located so for me it's just in downloads and then it's Wi-Fi manager this one right here so what you're going to do is you're going to do get info again you're going to do this Then I'm gonna type in slash downloads slash then the name of it. This is case sensitive, so make sure you just get it right. Sorry, it might take me a while here. Make sure you type in the dot apk. If you don't see the dot apk, then just go to get info of the file. And then type, oh, you know, you should see it because I don't think, well, if you don't, then just hit, just uncheck the, the hide. Mine's is already unchecked. All right, so then you're going to hit enter, and then it's going to be doing its thing, and it'll be installed on my phone. As you can see, hold on. As you can see, it's now installed on my phone. I think you can see that right there. So yeah, guys, if you have any questions, just go ahead and leave a comment. Um, I'll put all the links in the description. And yeah, thanks for watching.